Hello, I'm Barney Maunder Taylor, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to make a Christmas card icosahedron. Now, an icosahedron is made of 20 triangles and usually looks like this. But in this model, instead of 20 triangles, we're going to be using 20 circles that have been cut out of old Christmas cards. So you'll need to find something round to draw around and then you'll need to cut out 20 circles out of old Christmas cards, like this. I'm now going to get this triangle, which I've cut out from a piece of stiff cardboard um, in such a way that it fits nicely inside the circle, and I'm going to use it to turn each of my 20 Christmas card circles into 20 Christmas card triangles. So the last step is to glue them all together. Just make sure that five Christmas card triangles meet at each point, like this section that I've already done. Now is also a good time to tape a ribbon to the inside to help for hanging. enjoyed making the Christmas card icosahedron, why not try out some of my other designs? For instance, this Christmas card dodecahedron. This is made of 12 Christmas card circles bent up to make pentagons. Or how about this cube octahedron? This is just made of six squares and eight triangles. But if you're going to make a cube octahedron, why not make a rhombic cube octahedron? This fella's made of eight triangles and 18 squares. Now, if you're gonna make the rhombic cube octahedron, then why not make this design, which combines the icosahedron and the dodecahedron, making it an icosidodecahedron. Now, obviously that means it's gonna be made of 20 triangles and 12 pentagons. But then why stop there? Because you may as well go the whole hog and make this Rhombic icosidodecahedron. Yeah. Now this one's made up of um, one, two. Um, this is made up of lots of triangles and squares and pentagons. Yeah. So whatever you do, don't throw away your old Christmas cards. Make them into shapes. Thanks for watching this video, and see you again soon.